welcome to the Royal School of Needlework. My name is Gemma Murray and I'm the Studio Project Manager here at the Embroidery Studio at Hampton Court Palace. All work undertaken by our specialist team is done so by hand and we pride ourselves on that high standard of work produced here in the UK. This piece we're working on at the moment is a very exciting project. It's a restoration um, commission and it has been um, brought in to us from Highclere Castle. So the item itself is the uh, coronation outfit worn by Countess of Carnarvon. It was worn in 1911 at the coronation of George V. The outfit itself consists of a number of elements. So laid out here you can see the bodice and the underskirt. Over the top is a velvet skirt panel. There are two tassels, there's also a hood and a larger train. We have to make sure we document absolutely every element and measurement, recording as many different pieces that we can. We take lots of photos, so we document all the holes, any damaged areas. We mark out where items that need to go back match up to. Once we have photographed and documented, we then begin the restoration work. So we have started here with a light surface clean, so all the elements will have a surface clean, and we do that using a very low suction conservation vacuum. And what this does is it lifts any surface dust or dirt that may be living on the top of the textile, removes it without damaging any of the fibres of the fabric that are still there, and it just prevents any further damage. So things like insects or moths that could be living within are lifted and taken away. You'll notice on lots of the um, outfit sections, there is a trim that sits around all the edging. The trim that you'll see on the different elements is very weak in a number of places. So what we need to do is we need to stabilise that and prevent any further damage or loss. In parts of the gown, there are holes and splits which is normal to items of clothing that would have been worn. So what we do is we make sure we support these weak areas, securing it with stitching to stop the, the hole spreading. We've also um, noticed, because there are gemstones on the lace insert here, they're quite heavy, there are a number of holes. So we've supported those holes also, and we pride ourselves on these types of repairs because they are discreet. The large train has an even bigger trim than what you can see here on the bodice, so we have to make sure that that is all stabilised as well. Um, because of the weight of the train on the dress, we've made particular attention to the top here that it is secure. There are some surprises. Sometimes they're nice, sometimes they require a little bit more attention and time from our specialist team here. Um, one such problem that we've actually come across is with the trim. Um, particularly on the larger train of the dress due to the weight and it's also dragged on the floor. The velvet has weakened a lot so we are actually having to support it a lot further than we thought we were going to have to. Here at the Royal School of Needlework we're quite unique. Um, all of our team are trained here at the school and part of our training is that we work on commissions in a group. For example, if I started to work on a section, I could work, my colleague would then come along, could take over from where I've started, carry on, you wouldn't see a difference in the stitching, they can go, I can come back, and it will just look like one continual row of stitching. This is ideal for jobs of this scale because we have a deadline to meet, um, so it means that there is somebody working on it all the time. Quite often once we've finished a piece it normally goes back to its owner and we don't see it again but what's exciting with this project is that it will be going back to Highclere Castle. There's a lovely connection with Highclere because the Carnarvon family have always lived there so it's going back to their home and it will be on display to the public in September and we're really hoping that we can go and have a look too.